Guys, what's up? It's Brian back here again with another guitar tutorial. I had to get a good, like, thumbnail for this. I just wanted to, like, do, you know, I mean, it's props. Crocheting needles. But, you know, I needed something big enough so I could go, you know, something like that. I just took several thumbnails. <laughs> Music for a sushi restaurant. We got this great little bass line. Show you how to play that, and then we've also got this this great little. Uh, I'm going to show you how to play that a little bit more clearly than that. Like and subscribe. Let me know other songs you want to learn on guitar. Uh, let's get back to kind of our normal thing here. Whoop. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to show you the chords first. F sharp. Okay. One of two ways you could do it. If you want more of a full beginning here, you can do it this full bar chord, two, four, four, three, two, two. If you need help reading the numbers, by the way, there's an Instagram post. You can go down uh, in the comment section, click on that. Follow me there for more uh, tips and tricks and fun, right? The other way you could do F sharp uh, is to come up here and do 998, so 9th fret A and E, uh, and then 8th fret D, and then you got those X's there. I don't want you to play those other strings. So what I do is like a soft bar, basically. I'm not holding down any of these other strings down here. I'm just muting them with a very soft bar. I'm not pressing down. Right? Pressing down would, would look a little bit more like that. So I'm just soft bar. Right? So I'm letting the first three strings shine through and the next three strings, they don't, you don't hear from them. Just sounds like some background chucking, basically. This is my preferred method to do this song, okay? Because the other way to do it like this, and then you gotta come over here and still do that. And that, you know, um, volume-wise, doesn't work out as well. But if you want to do it this way, you got E, okay? And then we're going to do uh, E on the other way is 776. And then again, still Xing everything else out, all right? Then we're going to do a D sharp. So from that E, you come down one more fret, 665, hold the rest. And then we'll go to D, 554. Uh, X, 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 might as well, X is all out, okay? So start on F sharp, down, 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 up, down, up, and then E, down, 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 and up, down, up, kind of thing. And then D sharp, down, down, and up, down, up. Okay, and then D, down, up, down, down, and up, down, down, up. E, down, up, F sharp. So really it's like a down, 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 up, down, up, down, up, down, down, and up, down, up, or sorry, down, up, down, up, down, up, and then D sharp, down, down, up, down, up, D, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, E, down, up, F sharp, okay? And then we go back to that bass line. Let me show you how to play the bass line. It's gonna take a while to get it right, okay? But you're gonna start on the second fret, E, and then octave it up to the 14th fret. Okay. So what I'm doing here is I'm going, right? I'm I'm just plucking it once on that two and then sliding up to the 14th. And then plucking the second time on the 14th fret. So it's da da ba, and then 11th fret. Rest. And then next time, you're going to go to 14, 14, 11, and then A11. And do a little, like, stretch your string out a little bit. Right? Give it a little wiggle. And, and that'll give you that little... Right? We want that little... <laughs> uh, and then you go back to the other part, and then you're good to go. So, if you have any questions, shoot me a comment down below. Uh, DM me on Instagram at bmartinsounds. Follow me there for more stuff. 
Uh, you know, I'm also on TikTok sometimes, so check me out there. Uh, you can subscribe here though while you're at it, and then uh, I'll have some other Harry Styles down below for you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.